Alright, never mind, I have plenty of space left. Let's go! Let's go power this place up. I don't remember where I needed to go, but let's do it. It might have been this way? Question mark? That's a big fall. I guess we're gonna figure out. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this isn't the place. But we're gonna find out. place I think yeah cuz I had to figure out how to get up there okay how do I get up there <laughs> not that way cool um I just want to get up there <laughs> here we go again no it's that way think. Right, well, anyways, let's just try to find this place. Nope. What are you doing? Desmond, please. Um. Oh. 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 This might be it. Yeah. Yeah. Found it. All right. So then we plugged it into here. And where does it go from there? Looks like it might be over there. Oh! Ow. <laughs> might be something over here. Oh. Is this the way? Oh. Okay. Um, that's cool. My screen just went black. That was cool. Alright, let's continue. Oh, that was cool. More story time. A new world approached. One that was dark and cold. Bad. It would consume us. For we were flesh, and flesh is frail. Though suits and shields might offer comfort, such adornments would not suffice. Not to save us all. So we sought to change what we were. In this manner, we might thrive in a world made poisonous. It was Aita who volunteered to see if it might be done. Aita, my husband, my love. In the end, it changed him, ruined him. He was made a prisoner of the machines. The body might survive, but his mind became brittle to the touch. He begged me for release, for days, for weeks, for months. I pleaded with him to give us time to find another way. But, but there, there wasn't, wasn't one. one. Not, Not for, for him. him. Not, Not for, for us. us. Well then. I see. Now where do I go? Um, looks like right, like this. Wrong way? Push the mark? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Here we go this way. Ah, I did it. Yay! Is there more? Oh, that was close. Go, Desmond, you can do this. I believe in you. You're the hero that we need, not deserve. Batman. Alright. Now where am I going? Oh. What is consciousness but a series of electrical impulses? And the body, a vessel to hold these sparks. Right. But it is weak. In time, it decays and crumbles into dust. Alright, good talk, good talk. We asked ourselves then, what if it might be replaced with something stronger? 
something better. So we forged a new vessel, one that might endure. It proved easy enough to enter. What difficulty? But to leave, to leave required something more, something wrong. And so this too they abandoned. I wondered though, were they right to turn away? Hmm. Right. Where am I now? Jump in that way? Yeah, jump in that way. Okay, let's go. Okay, can't go that way. Oh, can I? Can I? Nope, okay. Let's go this way. Whoop. Whoop. Where the heck am I going? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Another one busts the dust. Is that the last one? I guess that was the last one. Holy crap, I didn't think so. Is that blood? Nope, that's just rocks. Alright then. Let's get going. Yo, let's plug this in. I regret not asking you to hack into the Abstergo servers while you were there. A couple of well-placed relays and we'd be swimming in information. We have everything we need. Yeah, except the key. We're close. We have the and key. No. I just do. I've been poking around a bit. Oh my god. Did you know there are machines down here that make, well, mana? Wizard mana or biblical mana? What do you think? Biblical, of course. The Greeks called it ambrosia. The Indians, amrit or soma. Most cultures around the world refer to a divine food, though I'd say its taste is anything but. Something that came out of a 75,000 year old machine. <laughs> and I live to tell the tale. So? What did it taste like? Cardboard. Tasted of cardboard. Hardly the stuff of legends, though. I wonder if the first civilization didn't taste differently than we do. Maybe the flavorizer broke. Flavorizer? You certainly got away with words, Rebecca. Alright, how do I plug this dang thing in? Yo! Plug this in. Things are getting worse outside. What do you mean? Every day for the past two weeks, the sun has been throwing off. <sighs> okay. I thought that was the last thing, but... Oh. <clears throat> right. I knew that. Wait, no. What? That's not... You don't put that in. Oh, my God. <laughs> Guess this is it. All right, let's go. We're right behind you. Let's do this. Banda, 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 banda. Right behind me, they say. Cool. Let's do this. Oh. Moment of truth. Moment of tooth. How many times has that string been ripped off, like seriously? Alright. Okay, this one's dead. He's just like, what the crap? Let's go. I don't waste time. I'm ready for this dance. It's been a super long game, but it's been very enjoyable. 
Yes. Come. What is it? Here, at last. You know our story now. Of how we tried. Of how we failed. Mm -hmm. All our hopes extinguished. Save one. Your touch. A spark. A spark to save the world. Wait! What? Do not touch the pedestal. Minerva? You! But how? You left! You destroyed the device! Did you think there was only one? What the hell is going on here? You must not free her. What? Free her? Juno dwells within these walls, awaiting release. I will explain. While we worked to save the world, she sought instead to conquer it. Oh she used our machine to set her plans in motion. Divination through numbers. There is a pattern to existence. To comprehend the calculations is to tame time. This was my focus. And so I built the eye to aid us. But she turned it towards her own ends. When we discovered her treachery, we put a stop to it. And then we left. But first we called to you, that you might try again. We thought it would be safe with her gone. Now I see we were deceived. She survived, she endured, and then she began to work. For centuries, Tinia and I walked the world, hoping to rekindle the spark of civilization. We shared what we knew as best we could. We were not the only ones, but for all the power we wrought, still death would claim us. But before it did, I would have one last look to know if we had succeeded. That's how you're here now? I had hoped you might find this place and finish our work. But it is too late. But you and the Templars have squabbled over our refuse. You have wasted centuries. And so you have lost your chance. You cannot hope to stop the end now, Desmond. Only to survive. She's lying! Only touch the pedestal and the world will be saved. Better the world burn than she be loosed upon it. Is that so? Show him then. But he will not understand. What is happening? It is complicated. It is... Show me. If you heed Minerva, the sun will have its way. The ground will crack and spit fire into the skies. All the world will burn. But this does not end the world. Merely heralds its arrival. Darkness follows. Then you emerge, resolving to lay a foundation that such a tragedy does not befall the world again. You will become a symbol to those who survive. Hope, knowledge, determination you will inspire them to rebuild to thrive once more and as the world heals so too will humanity but you are just a man frail and mortal you pass from the world leaving behind only a memory a legacy <laughs> you will be remembered first as a hero later as a legend and in time as a god it is the cruelest fate to have written words that meant well and see them made wicked and unwise. What was meant to encourage life, used instead to justify taking it. And so now you see that what was shall be again. What? So tell me, how is this better 